It's one of those things people always want to ask about is, like, why metal? What would make you want to play metal? What the fuck? Ah, you fucked up. If I was being 100% honest, I'd say it's, like, how I was raised. And, uh, when I was a young person and I got into music, I really got into music. I mean, my parents are crazy hippies, but they were also pretty brutal. I mean, the life they led was intense. And they, they taught that to me. Both my parents definitely taught me to be very intense and to be very devoted to stuff and be creative. The number one attractive thing, even when I was little, was that it was fucking intense and it was visceral and it was a real experience. I started out by playing uh, string classical instruments when I was a kid at school and um, guitar was a natural extension of that. For someone who started out in the guitar interest of music, metal was perfect. Um, I like the precision and the accuracy and the intensity of playing. I was seduced by the guitar, but the culture of metal reflected my personality. I was always intense and I learned to be fucking brutal. And I like lots of kinds of music. I, I, I listen to rap music. I really enjoy industrial music. And there's a lot of other things I like for technique. But what trumps everything is fucking metal, because there's no other art form like it. I have no other truer expression than to be screaming in a microphone. And I mean, what I grew to really like is the precision. Uh, I like the speed. I like the technical ability. I like how hard it is to fucking play. I like metal for the speed and the brutality. And I like to add musicality. And I hope that's what makes me a little bit different. Now, I try to hold myself to a standard that I believe in, where I don't really believe in bullshit songs about shitty topics. I like real shit. Now, I'll tell you this. If you find something else, musically, that's on the cutting edge of fucking outlandish artistic behavior, you get my attention. But the truth is, metal, so far, is fucking king. The only purpose of music is to function as a nonverbal language for emoting emotions without the bullshit of culture of language. Make the argument that the the brutal vocals, which is the thing that everyone gets hung up on, uh, really portrays the nonverbal nature of the communication. For all y'all haters that be hating on brutal vocals, you can go fuck yourself. That shit is operatic technique and way intense. Be impressed if you come up with five seconds of really brutal screams if you've never done it before. I don't think you could do it for five minutes. I mean, if you were to add up what it takes to be a metal band, you gotta have somebody who devoted that much guitar, bass, vocals, and drums. Let's not even start. Metal drumming has progressed way beyond any kind of boundaries that were ever existed before. Today, regular guys sound like gods. I would also say that if we were to look at existentially overall at all the different types of music with the advent of the digital age, only metal embraced the changes. The metal has revolutionized in the digital age, how it's recorded, how it's distributed, and how people enjoy it. If Beethoven or Bach were alive today and composing and they wanted to do something that was truly bombastic, they'd probably write metal. So my impression of every metal singer ever. I do also promise that even if you aren't a metalhead, you're still my friend. Because I'm a silly bitch and I'll do anything for a laugh. <laughs>